Hope you're all doing well. I'm going to go ahead and try and make this short and quick. So let's say you're born in the U.S. and at a very young age you're taken to China and you're raised there and for many years. What would end up happening? You'd take on their culture, their ways, their traditions. You'd think like them, react like them. And that goes for anywhere you would go and you're raised there for a long time. You'd just be programmed by the environment in which you're raised in. If you're in the jungle, you're going to become more um, at one with nature. So what I'm saying is that we're in a system. We're trapped in this system. And it's this whole world, this whole earth that's trapped in a system. We are being controlled by people and we think we have choices and that we're free. But in reality, we have to pay for every single thing that we have. We shouldn't have to pay for anything. It's all in abundance. Water, air, energy. <laughs> it's all in abundance. Food. We shouldn't have to pay. There's a system set up for us to fail. We are set up to fail. But there is a way out. There's an exit. There's a place we can go. We can make heaven on earth again. Every compass is pointing north. Every single compass points north. We are drawn here. Our hearts, if our hearts weren't in a hex, they'd probably go towards it. This is where the tree of life used to be. Every culture has it. It's the tree of life. It's at the center of our dish and X marks the spot. It's shown to us. Signs and symbols, it's everywhere. There are lots of videos out now to help you see. But there is a key to getting out of this matrix, this system. And it's through our intention. It's up to you to put your divine life force, your blood, over your intent to bring forth heaven on earth for the benefit of all. If you want to change things, this is how it's done. Our silence was consent and got us into this system, and now we're taking back our divinity. We know we're free beings.